An update to a story we first brought to you last week on Action News. Last Tuesday, we told you about the robbery in West Philadelphia that nearly claimed the life of the victim's best friend, a dog named Billy. Today, we heard from Billy's owner about the moment his companion was wounded trying to protect him. Action News reporter George Solis now live outside the Penn Veterinarian Clinic with a story you'll only see on Action News. George. That's right, Brian. Billy the Bull Terrier is here at Penn Vet after undergoing his second surgery today. Well on his road to recovery after that shooting, his owner tells us he's willing to do anything to save his pet's life, but we credits with saving his. Billy the Bull Terrier has been Felipe Sinistera's best pal for the last four years. Given to him by his grandmother at six months, Felipe has raised Billy to be a faithful and loyal companion. He is always protective. He he he's always been with me at my side. That loyalty was put to the ultimate test earlier this month when Felipe became the victim of a robbery here at the intersection of South 48th Street and Osage Avenue. Felipe says he had just gotten off work around 2 a.m. when he took Billy on a walk. The dog barks them, uh, trying to defend us, and because of that they shoot him. Felipe says two shots were fired, one of them striking Billy in the chest. Police have been looking for two suspects last seen getting into a gray Honda. Felipe says all that was taken from him was his cell phone. He says he would have given up anything if it meant sparing Billy. It's nothing. I, 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 I hope that they, they could have more things in my pocket for this truck him. Billy has now undergone two costly surgeries at Penn Vets Ryan Hospital for injuries sustained to various organs, including his heart. Felipe is crediting Billy's recovery so far, largely in part to support from family, friends, and the community, especially police who led the escort to the vet hospital after Billy was shot. But the vet bills are mounting, so he has started a GoFundMe fundraising campaign to help with costs. He's now putting up these flyers to help spread the word. Even a message of good energy helps him, you know. And who wouldn't want that for a friend, especially one as heroic as this one? All that he wants was protect us. Now I just checked in with Felipe. He tells me Billy is still undergoing surgery. If all goes well, it is likely he will spend a few more days here at the hospital. We are live outside Penn Vet Veterinary Medicine. George Solis, Channel 6, Action News. Jeanette. Hopefully Billy has a speedy recovery. Thanks so much, George.